Is beating Lyme arthritis truly possible? Let's uncover the evidence. Understanding Lyme arthritis is like trying to solve a puzzle. Today, we delve deep into the battle against Lyme disease and its formidable adversary, Lyme arthritis. Can it be conquered or is it a lifelong battle? Welcome viewers, I'm Dr. Chapman, a board certified rheumatologist with years of experience wrestling with the intricacies of autoimmune and inflammatory diseases, including the elusive Lyme arthritis. Today, we embark on a journey to demystify this condition, exploring its symptoms, diagnosis, and the latest treatment strategies. Whether you're a patient, a caregiver, or simply curious, join me in unraveling the complexities of Lyme arthritis. It all starts with a tiny tick bite, transmitting Borrelia burgdorferi, the bacteria behind Lyme disease. This condition can stealthily progress manifesting as fatigue, fever, and possibly a distinctive rash. The rash is called erythema migrans. But when it advances untreated, it can lead to Lyme arthritis, targeting your joints with painful bouts of swelling, especially the knees. Lyme arthritis is a late stage manifestation presenting as episodic swelling and pain, mimicking other conditions like rheumatoid arthritis. The symptoms include pain, swelling, redness, and warmth around the affected joint. Diagnosis is made by a combination of clinical judgment and serological testing. However, false positives can make it difficult to interpret the results of a study. The first step to effective treatment is an accurate diagnosis. The IDSA, AAN and ACR provide a structured approach for early stage Lyme disease. Oral antibiotics are the first line of defense. But what happens when Lyme evolves into Lyme arthritis? Treatment steps up with oral antibiotics in this case, and if ineffective, progresses to intravenous alternatives. Yet a small fraction of people might experience what we call antibiotic refractory Lyme arthritis. In this event, treatment requires a more nuanced approach. Despite the challenges, Lyme arthritis often responds well to antibiotics. For those with persistent symptoms, additional treatments like NSAIDs, intraarticular steroids, or DMARDs come into play. These include hydroxychloroquine and methotrexate, both medications used for the treatment of rheumatoid arthritis. It is thought that the bacteria may have triggered an inflammatory response, which requires immune modulation to stop the process. The term chronic Lyme disease remains controversial. The clinical guidance emphasizes a judicious approach underscoring the importance of clear evidence for continued antibiotic use. But some patients and doctors believe that this approach may be too conservative. Exciting developments in genomics and biomarkers held a future where Lyme arthritis treatment could be tailor-made to each person's molecular profile. It's a promising horizon that could transform how we actually manage this condition and many others. As we look ahead, it's crucial to ground our understanding and treatment of Lyme arthritis in sound evidence-based medicine. Emerging vaccines, novel diagnostics, hint at a promising future for combating Lyme disease more effectively. For those enduring Lyme arthritis, it's more than just physical pain. It's a journey that demands a compassionate, holistic approach to care. Supporting one another from patient groups to mental health care is fundamental. With knowledge as our ally, the fight against Lyme arthritis is far from hopeless. Awareness, preventative measures, and timely consultation with healthcare professionals are your beacons. Your journey with Lyme arthritis doesn't have to be one of suffering and confusion. Armed with today's insights and your own resilience, you're well-equipped to navigate this challenge towards a brighter, healthier future. Remember, Empowering yourself with knowledge and timely action can transform the battle against Lyme arthritis from a daunting struggle to a journey of hope and triumph. Let's take that first step together. Thank you for joining me today. Stay curious, stay empowered, and take care of your health. Together, we can turn the tide against Lyme arthritis. Subscribe for more insights, and remember, there's always hope on the horizon. See you next time.